Lunara on this map there for a little bit. I don't want to, you know, I don't want to talk too early in the chat. I don't want to seem over eager. We got a Deckard. And do I have a Alterac Pass tank pick for myself? Eh, May's heading down a little bit. Muradin. Interesting. ETC, Blaze, and Malganus a little lower. That makes sense with all the open space. I mean, Asmo, a ghoul? What? Who? What? Who? Okay. What? Okay. I don't think people randomly ban. I assume they know something I don't, and I want to learn whatever the cool thing is. Is he banning? Oh, he was going to pick Gould. Okay, so we got a Gul'dan Asmodan looking like, and then a Bruiser. Gul'dan Asmodan Bruiser, huh? We got ETC. Uh, we could still look at Johanna. Are they thinking Muradin? I'm down with a, a Murd and Bruiser going back in that Li Ming, but we still need a front line. We're so spell damage based. Whoa, okay. Hmm. Super weird. Maybe I think about Deathwing? I can help interrupt the Stitches ETC stuff. Hmm. It doesn't look like I'll get an answer. And they still have a DPS pick. I'm glad I get to go last. Plus, Deathwing would look awesome on the snowy map. The hunt is on. Lunara. Oh, Lunara. Ready for adventure. Huh. What do we have to pressure Lunara, though? We don't really have anything to get her. Do I need to go Thrall for the Lightning? The right-click poke that helps us complete kills? Uh, I think we're going to stick with the original plan, because I don't want to be Thrall yanked around in the blind and all of that. But I fear Lunara is going to be running free. Hopefully she just gets hit by all the Gul'dan stuff. She dies and it's wonderful. And I help take care of Gul'dan by not being CC'd. College dead. <laughs> rough. Rough name. Rough name, bro. I was reminded last night while talking with Garrett of a little cartoon cartoon called Roughnecks. If any of you saw it, it was very much in that Beast Wars era of computer graphics, so it looks pretty damn rough these days. 
But I remember loving Roughnecks. These Starship Troopers. Basically, it was StarCraft, the TV show. It was awesome. No Protoss, though, as I remember it. Okay. Hmm. I think I am... Did I watch Reboot? Yes, which actually I think looks okay still, because it was, like, stylized and in a computer, and I think the style helped it out a lot. Anything that was going for more realism, like Beast Wars and stuff, just ooh. Well, I really like Draconic Might, but I think we should do Dragon Soul. Because we're going to be attached to people, and I still don't really know what, uh... What build I'm going to want to do here. So is Malthio going to head top? Nope. Cool. Reboot was also on cable TV, and I didn't have access to it as a kid. Is this auto attack ETC? Probably, given the stitches pick up. But I've got pretty beefy auto attacks. Broke my armor. <laughs> He's actually gonna gonna win that over time. Fair enough. Let's let's be a little aggressive here as uh, Malthiel shows up. Not public access, well, not public access, but you know what I mean. Normal TV, non-cable. Had Yu-Gi-Oh! And... And there was a lot of weird shows I watched that I don't really remember too much of. Like Iker Mice from Mars. Lots of knockoff stuff like Street Sharks. I can get up done here. This is actually going to be an okay hit. I'm going to win in the lane collapse, too. Alright, let's get into space. And depending on the grouping, we'll see if I can land with a little bit of destroyer action and flame some people while ETC's not in range. Come on, live, 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 Gul'dan! I need to grab well, and they're getting on our thingy. Clone High? I'm not familiar with Clone High. I can't go into Lunara. Malthio can finish that up. I would love level 7. And Gul'dan's gonna be caught out? Yeah, he's gonna get CC'd. Now 
Now, I didn't really think about the double poison aspect of uh, our game here, but yeah, that is a factor. Hopefully with the late game CC we have and my ability to avoid it, we'll be in a better spot. Something I think would be really cool is a auto attack damage increase while in destroyer form. Maybe like a spell damage increase in World Breaker just to, just to differentiate them a little bit. They're going to complete that, no problem. So that'll be good. my buns back top. I'm not really. I thought I could have sworn. Wasn't there a book though of uh, Starship Troopers that probably came before all of the movies and stuff? Yeah, he's doing stage dive, so we gotta watch ourselves. Because anywhere I go, he can go faster. Wow, Malthiel's actually going with the Oblivion. the AOE alt into these big boys. These alliance dogs seek to keep our warriors under lock and key. I really enjoyed the Ghostbusters cartoon when I was a little, little. Nice done there. See, if Decker can get a... Ah, I was off site. Okay, that'll push in a little bit. I just wanted to get rid of the catapult. The real Ghostbusters, exactly. The very same. Because they couldn't get licensing for the Ghostbusters name? I mean, it, 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 you know, the world's a weird place. We're just gonna take it slow. All right, there's the angle. All right. uh, he's getting healed, which is good. This fight is 
Oh man, did they not kill that? Let's see. That middle's gonna be destructive, but... Uh-oh, okay, well, the tank. Alright, we're done. I'm eager to pay the Alliance back. Let's help them with that. Right, I'll push up the bottom lane in the middle and then join. Grab a well. All right, here we go. See if I can fear him into my team. We kept Lunara back, which I think was a good way to cut off a lot of their damage. At least I'm assuming, because he's been kind of running free. And it looks like Li Ming is actually. Uh-oh. How much we can do for old Deckard. Good stun on Li Ming, actually. Wow, she ended up right in the middle of it. It's gonna be a tiny breath, but it might be enough to... I need to go into space. It will take more than that to stop the okay, I think we're doing pretty well. Granted, we kind of even things up, but we found a strategy that's working. Actually, kind of surprised Stitch has made it there so fast. I thought I'd get to pal around for a little bit. Well, my next big read is Gideon in the Ninth, I think is uh, what Garrett said, but it's a very little popular book right now. They're checking top. Playing around boss area. All right, they're putting effort into. I think we uh, we got bottom wall. There's Lunara. Our warriors need There's ETC. So they can fight for us once more. Oh jeez. Well, that's a shame. We had a instant refresh, but from all the meteors that hit. The Secret Life of Trees? I am not familiar with that, actually. They're all backing. Let me walk up with this boss and see if I can get something done. Hey, Edgar, good to see ya. My shadow. 
Nice stun on Li Ming there. Very cool. Oh, too bad they got it. Okay, well, we're decently pushed out, I guess. And we do not get top four. I think we're landing on a lot of people. Let's do a rival of a god. And then we clear top, and that's about all they get out of it, but... So not a thrilling. Go get a Murden. Did they get control of bottom boss? It took that many hordes to stop our cavalry. True. My shadow will engulf this realm. This realm is now they're 20. Oh, he's going with the cooldown. Or the not the cooldown. That's not what it does anymore. Oh, jeez, I'm going down. Oh, no. Oh, no. Rain of destruction. What? Oh, heal yourself. Heal yourself. Get the orbs. Wait, we've been busting buns to kill Rain of Destruction. Cool, then. All right. Get him, get him, get him, get him, get him, get him. Do mouth heal. Oh, 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 okay. Nice. Okay. Now, D-Wing's fun. Uh, they had, uh, they picked ETC and Stitches in the early draft, so we got... Oh, kill him. Nice. Oh, my good... Oh, my good... Oh, my goodness. Well, <laughs> that's leaving for you. The darkness prevails, but we... I found the orcs being held prison. Well, poop. <laughs> Uh, she shouldn't be able to clear our little minions, though, and I died really early, so we'll just kind of uh, sit back. I, will not be undone by some more I can clear mid, and then maybe... The dawn my new world. I can't land here, no, there's no sight. Get a camp. Same for level 20 talent. Let's see. Oh, Tal Rosh's elements. Interesting. Old school calamity. No, no, she wanted Triumphorate and the Calamity and all that. None can stand. I think we still go objective with all that damage still cooking. Yeah, sometimes you play Sacrificial Malthiel, right? But they have no frontline to come in on this anymore. Muradin is perfectly fine on health. 
It's gonna be a lot of XP in the bottom. A lot of XP in the bottom. At least I can go into space and maybe shore it up a little bit. But I don't wanna I don't wanna fully invest down here. Just in case things get crazy. Oh no, the prison camp. There goes the reign of destruction, Malthiel. Oh, nice and stoppable, Lily. I'm kind of happy we can't be healed because otherwise we'd be drinking all the potions that are keeping Malthiel going. Oh, big interrupt there. Yeah, he's, he's not even controlling his character. He thought he was going places. <laughs> he finally got one. Nice. What about this Mura? No, nah, he did good. He got in there and got some kills. And another one of those games where it feels like the Gorge kind of saved the person that got hooked. And those were good hooks. He got some long distance hooks. And if he hadn't gorged, we wouldn't have time to react. I agree. Deathwing, well, I was very afraid of the Lunara. I was very afraid of Lunara. She did not do the giant killer one. She went unfair advantage, which is still good. Oh, wait, more damage to heroes that are slowed, rooted, and stunned. Okay, so that doesn't even work on me. Calamity bringing it home, though. Yeah, we got to do a little soaking. I love getting to do the level 7, where I get cool, faster refreshes. Reduce the cooldown of Deathwing's landing abilities by two seconds. When Deathwing lands, he drops meteors, which do favor heroes. And then reduce the cooldown of Dragonflight by 25 seconds. And we got Arrival of a God, which means we had the other one that reduces spell armor? I think is the way it goes. Death drop. Hitting enemy with Destroyer World Breakers landing reduces their spell armor by 15 for 6 seconds and Deathwing's basic ability cooldowns by 2 seconds. That's right, because when you land, your basic abilities are on a cooldown. 